I don't know about you, but I have various different parts of myself and um, they generally tend not to agree with each other. Um, and these two, um, it, uh, yeah, they never agree with each other. Um, the Sleep Monster and Mr. Insomnia. So this one's called The Sleep Monster. He just wants to be fed, to crawl into bed and gorge on Zeds into sleep. But instead, Mr. Insomnia creeps under the duvet and into our lair and smashes the air with his big silver gong. My monster weeps into twisted sheets while sheep cavort in our brains. But still, Mr. Insomnia refrains from leaving the sleep-thieving little prick. <laughs> Monster says he feels sick, so we make some lists of A's, B's and C's. Try to name all the trees we've seen or places we've never been to, like Alcatraz, Bombay. Crew. <laughs> At quarter to four, he can't take any more, so I buzz for the night nurse. In she lumbers to numb us with her vile gloop sticky green soup that makes eyelids droop in the gloom. As I hold my monster, he curls his toes, his breathing slows till he's under, and Mr. Insomnia in a darkened corner stands, wearing his face of thunder. Logs fester at the back of the grate and marvel at their peeling bark. Don't touch me, I'm old! The mould creeps, cranky with damp, comfy in the ashes. Until you arrive with matches, bright eyes and twists of newspaper. I wait, watch you kneel patiently at the grate, fumbling the strike. One, two, three. A spark. The sudden stark bright light as my old heart ignites with a clunk and soars over the sunset at Ringing Road. The glow of a Sunday spent with someone. I remember who I am and how to feel. I steel myself to believe it's real. But three little weeks is all it takes to reveal a charlatan. Back in the ashes, I nurse my skulls, feeling used and stupid and old. Until I'm told by a wise woman whose words I trust that I must not blame myself. Sorry. That I must not place the blame on me, for I'm not too old for you. You're too young for me. I watch the headlines crumple as the coals turn white. But strangely, I'm all right. That's all for me. Thank you for your <laughs>